Hi everyone, Digga here. Today I'm taking a look at the Shark Pup Kickstarter plush toys by Ama Wilson. I got these back in August 2021. The Kickstarter itself ended in December 2020, and I've already posted about them on Twitter, but I wanted to film a short little video and show off just how cute they are. Let's get started. Can you dig it? Before we take a look at the Shark Pups themselves, I wanted to show off the stellar packaging and extra goodies. We got a big box here. It's got an adorable Shark Pup sticker. I wish there was a way to safely take this off. There probably is, but uh, I don't have the courage to do that. Swing it around to the side. When you open this up, it actually has custom Shark Pup wrapping paper. Look at this. Ooh, it's all crinkly. I think on camera it comes off a little more mint green, but in person it's a very, uh, it's like a very bright, vibrant, almost Christmas tree green. I like this so much that I actually don't want to throw it away. I want to find a way to preserve it. I guess I got to figure that out. Very nice. Here's the baggies for the shark pups. Obviously they're not in there right now. Please leave a message after the beep. And then we have the goodies. First off is a lovely little lanyard. Here's a close up of the lanyard design. We have the regular shark pup, the shiny shark pup, the bull shark pup, the tiger shark pup, and the hammerhead shark pup. I got the regular and the hammerhead because they were just irresistible. And, you know, I'd like to get the other one someday, but I'm pretty happy with what I got. And this design just kind of repeats through the entire lanyard in a nice, vibrant, green, neon color. I like it a lot. And then the rest of the Kickstarter extras are housed inside this nice, eco-friendly packaging. That's very cool. It's 100% mailer. So, we meet again. Fancy seeing you here. <laughs> I like it. It's very friendly, very reusable. You open it up and reach inside through here. Geronimo! Inside you'll find a Shark Pups official Kickstarter certificate of adoption, or multiple if you got multiple Shark Pups, obviously. You put down their name, who they belong to, what they like, and their favorite thing. I'm so glad you brought me home. You'll see there's the shiny Shark Pup shimmering in the light. And then all the other shark pups in a little pile, just having a good time. The bull shark's looking a little ready to pounce, but the rest of them are just kind of chill. Heading into the stretch goals, we have some trading cards. There was going to be a set of keychains that had to be cut, and then um, the last goal didn't get met, which was a cool mini comic. But we got these really nice cards, so let's take a look. First off, we have Shark Pup Round Friend. <laughs> As usual, the art is very cute, super adorable. There's the emblem in the top right. You have Shark Pup in all of its glory, hopping across this trading card. Afraid of a shark bite? What about a shark bark? The round friend Shark Pup is all about play, hugs, and friendship. No need to worry about teeth or rough skin. Next up is Shiny Shark Pup going against the Rapids. Is that a new species of Shark Pup? No, it's just a shiny. Shiny Shark Pups aren't any different from their gray siblings, but their bright colors make them really popular with collectors. I really like the shiny variant, but I had to stick with the OG. Next up is the bull shark pup. Ooh, ferocious. Bull sharks have a reputation, and for a reason. These stubborn sharks are known to be fiercely territorial, like a bold guard dog. They also boast the ability to swim in freshwater for a time, sometimes heading up rivers to hunt away from rivals. You better watch out, shiny shark pup. If you go any further, you're toast. Next up is the tiger shark pup. <laughs> Look at him just tearing open his fish. I mean, the owner probably just bought that, you know, that was probably like 10 bucks at a nondescript pet store and he just tore it right open immediately. The tiger shark isn't a picky eater. Besides the usual birds, fish, and other sharks, this chomper has been known to be found with car parts, paint cans, and even boat pieces in its stomach. Part of a complete breakfast? Next is the hammerhead shark pup with a <laughs> cute little work outfit, little construction hat. Wait, does he need a hammer if he is a hammer? I don't know. The hammerhead's odd eye shape doesn't just give them great 360 vision for hunting. It also helps them like a paddle to cut through the water on sharp turns. Useful when hunting fast fish, or when trying to get the job done on the work site, I guess. And last but not least, we have the Thresher Shark Pup, which is one that I actually really wanted as a plush toy. Like, just envisioning a smaller shark pup with a really long tail is... It just it would make a perfect plush toy, and unfortunately it wasn't part of the Kickstarter, but maybe one day it can happen. Something about this specific artwork for the Thresher Shark Pup gives me Sugimori vibes. I think maybe it's also the sort of cream background coloring. Thresher Sharks have big eyes and tiny snouts to make them cute, but their tails are their most noticeable feature, with it being as long as the rest of their body. They use their whip-like tails to stun prey, jump right out of the water, and generally just look dazzling. Yeah, I'm really hoping one day this gets a plush toy because I really, 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 really want it.
The cards themselves are very nicely laminated too. They got a very soft feel to them while also uh, still being relatively high quality feeling. And we got stickers. We have a microscopic sleeping shark pup with a tiny tongue sticking out. A shiny shark pup making its way downstream. We got the bull shark pup laughing at someone or just looking ferocious in general. Ha <laughs> ha! We have the tiger shark pup chomping down on a little bone. Insanely adorable. We got the hammerhead shark strutting his stuff with his big, big silly tongue sticking out. Blech. I love the hammerhead shark so much. What a goofball. One of my favorites. And last but not least, the shark pups logo with a big bark coming out of uh, the original design for the shark pup, which was the first Kickstarter, I believe. It was a more realistic looking shark pup, and these ones are more, uh, as you saw on the adoption card, round friends. All right, that's enough of the extra goodies. Let's get on to the main event, shall we? Boom. Shark pup. He's capsized. Oh, no. This is the shark pup plush, and I gotta say, this is absolutely adorable. Look at that tongue. Look at all the stitching. It's so nicely done. Those big, bold eyes. You got, like, the, the gills over here are nicely stitched, too. The giant fin. He's got the nubs. You know it. Nub confirmation. I love this so much. It's just such, it really is a round friend. I've been so excited to see this since the Kickstarter has been going on and can't stop squeezing it. It was definitely well worth the wait. Let's take a little bit of a closer look here at the tags. We have the shark pup emblem insignia iconic classic round friend. And down here we have the tag for Ama Wilson 2020 at nekoama.com with the shark pups bark logo. Big, soft, squishy, round, I don't even know what else to say about it. I just love this so much. It's such a cute, perfect design. A little biased because I love sharks, but you know, no big deal. Let's bring in Hammerhead, shall we? Bonk. Look at this perfect round friend. Hammerhead is just so good. Look at the way that the eyes just come off the front of the head. I don't know what the technical shark term is, whatever. He's got the nostrils. He has the big blippy tongue, as you've already seen. I mean, what more could a person ask for? These just came out so nice. They're so soft and so perfectly done. I'm just gushing. It's a gush fest once again. Here's his big emblem looking so nice. Very flat. I love that. I love the flatness. I love him so much. He's perfect. And that was a quick look at the Shark Pups Kickstarter plush toys. And my goodness, I can't stop gushing about how nicely these came out. I love, love, love these very soft friends with their big doofy tongues and their nostrils and everything. I wanted to get them all, but I really couldn't swing it in December 2020. So, you know, I went with my heart. I chose the hammerhead immediately. I got the classic design. I think it paid off in dividends. I'm not sure if these are still being sold or not. They might have already sold out long ago, but here's hoping that one day we get that really cute Thresher Shark Pup because I would love to own this. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.